Augusta A109 BA, number one helicopter wing, Volkshaw. Helicopter flown for us here by Lieutenant uh, Igor Kleiss. He's been flying since the year 2000. He uh, began this season with uh, two and a half thousand hours of flying time, of which over 1,700 are on this A109BA, and he's led this flight team for the past nine years. Quite an old design now, the A109, first flown in initial prototype form in August 1971. It wasn't until 1992 that the then Belgian Army Light Aviation, now part of the Belgian Air Component, took the type on charge. Yes, this is the A109 BA. The BA designation refers to the Belgian Army, which deployed the type in the anti-tank and close air support roles. Currently, the Belgian Air Component uses the A109 BA for fire support, medevac, anti-tank and reconnaissance roles. It's ironic in many ways that the uh, current 32 the Royal Squadron operate the 109 as well, but in a much different and uh, slightly less aggressive role than this. Uh, they operated obviously in the VIP and Royal Transport role, uh, but obviously the aircraft is equally as manoeuvrable. But uh, I would think that this would probably spill the gin and tonics if you did this. It might just do, yeah. The uh, design dates back to the late 1960s. Initially, as a single engine civilian machine. In 1969, it was redesigned as a twin engine helicopter. And it's one that's seen a lot of upgrades over the years. The examples of number 32, the Royal Squadron, that Spiv was just mentioning, are the AW109E Power version. That's a much upgraded version. There's also the stretched Power Elite type. And in the LUH, or Light Utility Helicopter guys, the A109, A109 now the AW109, AW for Augusta Westland, has attracted military orders from the likes of Sweden, South Africa and Australia. The Belgian use of the A109 as an anti-tank helicopter remains current, but the crews say that that's gradually winding down. The air arm attained its 100,000th flying hour on the A109 last year, and the special scheme on this display aircraft celebrates both this and 20 years of the A109 in Belgian <laughs> service. Presently, helicopter is used by the militaries of uh, some 12 nations, uh, Algeria, Albania, Chile, Italy, Malaysia, New Zealand, Nigeria, Peru, and Sweden among them. And many of the Italian militaries use this, as well as the uh, paramilitary organizations of which there are several in Italy, the Guardia di Finanza, the Finance Guard, Italian Police Forces, Fire Services, the Protezione Civile, the Carabinieri, the State Police, and the Italian Army. And in more upgraded versions, the A109 has proved very popular as an air ambulance, including with many UK police forces. The helicopter has a, a crew of two, a, a top speed of around 175 miles an hour. The engines are a pair of uh, Allison model 250 turboshafts. as seen by the uh, previously completed Tiger Turn and there the uh, small turn. Excellent. It's 18 Squadron from which the display crew comes. This was part of what was known as Wing Heli. It used to be based at Biaset, particularly when the aircraft were part of the Belgian Army, but recently they changed base to Bovachan. Tiger turn there with a 360 degree descending loop back into a stall turn. There were 46 A109s originally procured for the Belgian army. That number now somewhat reduced. In 
from an Air Force service, this is known as the Augusta Westland AW109E. Pitching up for another stall turn to come back in, repositioning for a uh, final tiger turn, reminiscent of the Morgan turn in the uh, just seen recently in the uh, Chinook display. Last few manoeuvres of the 109's display. A great opportunity for uh, photography as he should, in theory, pass down the runway doing a spiral taxi, uh, doing 360 pirouettes along the runway. And a chance once again to see the special markings we mentioned on this particular Augusta A109BA. Yes, markings which uh, celebrate the team's anniversary of 20 years and, as Ben said, the 100,000 flying hours of the A109 in Belgian service. Lieutenant Igor Kreis in the Belgian Air Components Augusta A109 VA. There is, I believe, another one of these helicopters in the static park, part of some quite extensive Belgian Air Component representation on the ground here this year. Two F-16s from their Tiger Squadron, 31 Squadron.